today I'm reviewing the Tower 28 Beauty SOS Daily Rescue Facial Spray because no product can have a title that's less than like two words. Gotta have the Tower 28 Beauty SOS Daily Rescue Facial Spray. It's like a gazillion words. But anyway, okay, uh, really quick, I just want to say purchase all these products with my own money. I'll never waste your time with sponsor ads or videos. So if you want to help support the channel, check out nobsbeauty.com, check out my Patreon community, or click on the link below. Okay, so I've been asked to review this several times, so finally get a chance to review it. So they call this a simple but effective pH balancing hypochlorous acid toner, which helps minimize visible skin irritation, redness, and keep flare-ups at bay. This multi-hyphenate spray powered by stable hypochlorous acid helps to soothe and nourish stressed out skin on the face and body including visible blemishes and sunburns while supporting the skin barrier. This product also has the National Eczema Association seal of acceptance. So there we go. Okay, my first criteria is packaging. No issues with the packaging. Cute little bottle. I have the sample size because if something comes in a sample size, I'm almost always going to buy that unless I know I love it. Uh, in terms of denatured drying types of alcohol, it does not contain any of those. It's also fragrance-free and has no noticeable scent. I forgot to write down the manufacturing location, but it looks like it is made in the U.S., so no issues with that. And then I'll get into the ingredients because there's only three of them, which I think is the least amount in anything I've reviewed ever. Okay, so ease of use. So use more in the evening. Uh, spray on dry, fresh, freshly cleansed skin. Let it dry down completely before applying moisturizer. Use for blemishes. Sunburn, rashes, eczema, post-workout, and post-procedure. The mist on it's very nice and fine. It's a nice, fine mist. I like that. Um, so easy to use. Morning, evening, whenever. You can use it as an extra layer. A lot of people just like to apply it right before bed, or if they're in a hurry, they only use this. Okay, so beneficial ingredients. It only contains three, uh, one of them being water. Second ingredient being salt water, sodium chloride, and then uh, hypochlorous acid, which is uh, going to be the reason to purchase this stuff. Uh, unless you're a big fan of water and salt, which you can probably get anywhere. But anyway, so there's many newish studies on this hypochlorous acid, which I abbreviate as HA, but every time I see HA, I think hyaluronic acid, so can't do that. Um, so it's a naturally occurring molecule produced by the immune system. Uh, it's highly active against bacterial, viral, and fungal microorganisms. It's also at, active against biofilm. It's an, is an, is an active, is active against biofilm and increases oxygenation of the wound site to improve healing. Um, natural hypochlorous acid is unstable. Although through technology it can be stabilized into an effective topical antiseptic agent. Some people are also um, using it for like hand sanitizer. So for wound care and scar management, uh, topical hypochlorous action conveys microbicidal and anti antibiofilm properties in addition to potency as a topical wound healing agent and may offer physicians an alternative to other less desirable wound care measures the safety of hypochlorous solution use demonstrated to be comparable to that of standard local antiseptives small studies demonstrated better results with the scar gel compared to silicone gel regarding the appearance of hypotrophic and keloid scars relief of associated pain because of all of this Hypochlorous acid can help with fungal issues as well as acne and breakouts. It can also be good for wound healing as well as used after procedures such as microneedling and anytime there are cuts or wounds. Um, might be nice of them to include like maybe like one other exciting ingredient that has antibacterial prop like honey or maybe like matacasa. I don't know. Something else? Because you got three ingredients in a little bottle. So, but... Looks like that one ingredient is showing some great promise and potential. And some of the before and after photos online are really impressive. So, although you got to take some of that with a grain of salt. Okay, in terms of animal testing, it's vegan, gluten-free, and cruelty-free. In terms of performance, uh, this will help fight off bacteria. It's worth considering for anybody with uh, breakout issues, persistent breakouts, fungal issues, 
or for wound healing properties. Um, and then the nice thing is for acne prone skin, there's no ingredients of note or issue. There's no acne jack ingredients in here. So that's a nice thing. Better be since that's the main selling point. Uh, in terms of the price, so uh, the full size is four ounces, 120 milliliters, and retails for $28. So for something that's mainly salt and water, it's really expensive in my opinion. Uh, maybe if they would have thrown in another exciting ingredient or something, it might have been a little bit more exciting, but um, it's a little pricey. In terms of the yip factor, uh, for those with really tough acne-prone skin or fungal acne issues, it's worth a try in my opinion. Uh, there's similar uh, generic type versions of this online or on Amazon and Etsy, so it might be worth checking out. It's just spending 30 bucks for three ingredients because uh, those ones online are a little bit more affordable. Um, but a lot of reviewers consider this product the miracle that their skin needed and were very impressed with it, so that impressed me. Um, so with the 10 being a perfect score, I gave this one a seven. It's certainly worth checking out, and uh, if it ends up working well for you, maybe find one of the generic or cheaper versions. But um, overall, people loved it. I didn't notice any differences either way, but that doesn't necessarily mean uh, it doesn't work because obviously a lot of people who reviewed it found it worked well for them. So um, anyway, interesting from you guys if you're one of the people that had miracle results with it or if you tried it and were kind of like, meh. It is what it is for 30 bucks. I don't know. So anyway, I love hearing from you guys and stay tuned for more tomorrow. Thank you so much. Bye, guys.